one of my favorite things to say whenever I'm approached by a business owner or an executive of a small, medium, or even large business where they don't have compliance is, okay, well, what happens when you do have compliance? What happens when a new law is passed and you're now required to do something? Do you have that plan in place? Let's be honest. Nobody likes paperwork. Everybody wants to drive the car. Nobody wants to actually sign for the car, right? I do the paperwork and I want to do the paperwork, whether you're an organization that has compliance or not, but essentially with no incident response plan, you are still subject to the same types of attacks, the same types of intrusion, the same types of attempts. Threat actors out in the world are more granular. When they pick you, they pick you. They wanna figure out a way in. They can do all those different things. So as an organization that doesn't follow compliance, it's better to have it than not to have it. It's better to have car insurance and never need it than to not have it and need it. So in that case, for those organizations that don't have compliance, you're either going to face that incident at some point or you're going to be dealing with compliance yourself at some point.